Hi, my name is Thomas Young, and this is Basketball Shot Distance. My claim is, how does distance from the hoop affect the field goal percentage of shots I make? I am predicting that the further away I get from the hoop, that the field goal percentage will go down more and more. The materials I used was chalk, a tape measure, a hat, and a basketball. The reason the chalk lines are there, which marks each spot I will be taking a shot from, from each distance. I, how I tested this was I took five shots from zero to 24 feet and multiples of two to get the field goal percentage from each distance. I also put the distance in a hat on a piece of paper to get the distances at random so I didn't get really warmed up on a shot from a certain distance and make them consistently from there. Lastly, I put chalk down to mark each distance I shot from. I also had my friend Joe do the same exact thing to get averages and shots from him too, to compare. This is my table, this is my table. M equals miss, which equals zero. B equals bank, which equals one. S equals switch, which equals two. That will be the quality of each shot. As you can see, I got all banks for zero feet, which will come out to one average. That's because the B equals one, which is a bank. And as you can see for distance two, those are all switches, which the average will come out to a two because that is a switch, which equals comes out to a two. And those are the totals, that's why the totals are like that, because B equals one and the S equals two. That's the whole thing. This is my friend's data. I'll give you guys a second to look at that. All right. This is my friend's graph. Uh, as you can see on the left over here, the orange, which goes up to a two, the orange bar goes up to a two because that is a swish that he made. And the blue bar graph on the very left, which will go to a one because that, was, that meant that was a bank. As you can see, he made no shots at 18, which there is no bars there. So where you will see not the same color that you will see from somewhere else, that means they did not make that shot. There you go. The shot quality average, as you can see, these are the closest distances. You read? It goes down the further away he gets because that's all. The blue bar, as you can see down here, will go up to a two, and some blue bars will go down to a one because this is the quality of each shot, which means this is a swish, which qualities up to a two. This is a bank, which qualities down to a one. That's why some are smaller. You will see some colors that are not there because he did not make that shot. This is my graph. As the same thing from the first bar graph. At 22, there's no bars because I missed them shots. Over here, from zero, that is distance zero. It only amounts up to a one because those are banks. Shot two amounts up to a two because those were all swishes. This is my hybrid shot quality. As you can see, mine also goes down the further away I get from the hoop. Last graph is this bar graph, which same thing. This blue is smaller, bigger than this blue because I meant that was a swish and the smaller blue was a bank. And the same colors are not, some of them are missing because I missed those shots. Conclusion, in conclusion, the field goal percentage went down the further I got from the hoop. Thank you for watching this video. Email me if you have questions. Goodbye.